what did I do with this? And this? And these? Well, if you're interested, why not continue watching and I'll tell you all about it. Some of you may be aware of my little black book where I have used the jelly plate papers, textured papers that I've made, cut them up and made little uh, collages in this A5 book. Um, there's plenty for you to have a look at. I'll leave a link if that's what you would like to see, but that's not what I'm going to show you today. Today I've decided to start a little grey book. And this is the little grey book in question. It's got grey pages. And what I thought I would do in this is um, use images that I have made or created. Uh, I am a photographer and digital artist and this is one of my prints uh, totally created by myself, uh, partly photography, partly collage uh, and um, using jelly plate, but every, everything is put together and this is the resulting print. So I thought I would use this in my little grey book. So what I did was I reprinted it and cut it out and uh, I've got a little cut out of the print that I've just showed you and I'm thinking of putting it into my little grey book and adding all the other images uh, that I've done over the past 15-16 oh, years uh, but I thought I would start out with this one. So um, I'm going to get the pieces together that I made on my jelly plate. Again I can leave you a link to these. These are on my channel and I'm going to go through them and see what would make a nice background for this lady here. So I think the first thing to do is try and uh, offer them up one by one to see which ones that I like, whether or not I want to just have one or a a couple like that. I put them to side to uh, one side, the ones that I like. I think that one's a little bit too busy, although it would maybe go with this one. Okay. Put those to one side. I like that one. No. <coughs> Do I like this one? That's not too bad. I quite like that one. Oops. Is that a bit too crazy? Is, I quite like it. Yeah, put that onto this pile here. I quite like that one as well. Those two go together. would go together, wouldn't they? So. so like those two. That one. 
do like this one. I'll try that with that. I quite like that one as well. It's kind of um, medieval to me. So this is uh, quite similar. It's going into the same colour background, isn't it? I know you're all screaming at the. Um, I know you're all screaming at the at your phone or on your computer, shouting to me, telling me which one to choose. But unfortunately, I can't hear you. Right, I think this is going to take quite a while, so I won't bore you too long. I'll. Uh, go through them, decide which ones I want to uh, use. I've also got another lady here. I could put her in there as well. Okay, let me have a think and I'll come back. So I've made my decision now and I'm going to have this here and this like that. And here's my lady. I think I'm going to call her Lady Anne. I don't know why, but that's who she is. And I've cut another two out. Um, and I'm considering putting those two there. Like that. Um, Obviously on the digital image that I uh, created, she's got these kind of swirls and droppy earrings. So whether I put those on or not, I don't know. Um, but I think it's got enough detail that she doesn't need any more embellishment. So I think I'm going to go with that. And so what I'll do now is I'll come back to you again once I've uh, glued them down or whether or not I've decided just to keep it as one person. So hmm. Okay, going to have a think, come back to you. So here's the first page of my little grey book and it's going to be filled with images that I've created as a digital artist. This is just one of them. <laughs> I've got on hundreds and hundreds of them. So we have this lady here that uh, has gone into the book and these are some of the papers that I showed you how I made recently on the jelly plate so I think it's a nice combination and I said when I was making these papers that I was going to show you what to do with them rather than just make lots and lots of jelly plate papers just for the sake of making them this one is a uh, hopefully an inspiration for, for you and for me to keep on going. I've got lots of pages to fill 
and uh, honestly I've got so many of these digital creations that I've made over the last 16, 17 years um, and I hope you'll enjoy seeing them as I populate the book. So thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.